today we're going to show you how to change your fuel filter and uh, this is a Ford F-150 you can do this in several different uh, mix and models of cars uh, this is where the this is what the fuel filter looks like this is where it's located I'm underneath my vehicle now see this the back wheel I'm on the driver's side it's about half it's located about halfway in between the um, the halfway in between the wheels on the driver's side that's what it looks like before you begin working on your fuel filter you have to depressurize your fuel pressure now if you don't have any special tools anything like that you can depressurize the uh, the fuel system by disconnecting your inertia your inertia switch which is in my description if you do not know how to do that um, you just depressurize your, your system first and foremost and then you get up under your vehicle you can either jack it up and I mean if you fit under your vehicle then so be it but I'll put the camera down and I'll show you how to change this fuel filter now sorry about that see the camera here so you guys can see everything step by step there we go now, first thing you want to do, take these clamps off, both sides. All you do is push the clamp up, disengage it, then take it out of the C-clamp, I mean out of the clamp. Again, push the clamp towards, then up out, up, then let it come up out of here, fold it back. Now, the only th you should have something after you depressurize the system and uh, disconnect these clothes, these hoses. There may be some excess fuel still in the in here, so you want to have a towel or you know, I have my little bucket here. It's not really necessary for you to have a bucket, you could just use a towel, but you will need a disconnect tool. These are quick connects onto the, onto the poles. This is what your new one looks like. So you see the kind of pole, the kind of attachments on the end. What the disconnect, what this does, you put this around here and inside the coupling. And when it goes inside the coupling, it will detach, detach the coupling from your fuel filter. So that's what we're gonna do with this one right here. Put that down. Make sure you have the right size, of course. This thing costs less than $10 from Auto Repair Stop. It goes around your fuel filter thing, and then you push it inside. I'm trying to do it at an awkward angle so you can see what's being done. Then you push it in there, and this will disconnect. So I got it all the way off there. There we go. There's a little bit of fuel in there. I could just pour it out and have you. But since it's up like this, I don't really gotta waste too much fuel because I could just leave it right there. You're gonna do it to the same same thing to the other side. Dripping a little it's a little bit of drip there. If you're gonna be under there, it's a dangerous splash and you might wanna have uh, goggles on. Definitely a good idea to have your goggles on. So you don't get splashed in the eye. Push this in there. There it goes. Then that should just pull right out. Uh, shoot. Did I get it out? There we go. Putting the hoses up just so that uh don't get no splash. I mean, like hold this a little bit. So it's not splashing all over the place. This clamp. I'm gonna do this clamp here. So that's just a regular clamp. Pull out your filter. I'm gonna leave it in there because it's annoyingly dripping fuel all over the place. Take our replacement filter. 
also you want to check to make sure your hoses and your clamps are still looking pretty good. If, any, if there's any kind of wear and tear or anything like that, of course, replace your hoses, replace your clamps. This new guy right in here. Then all we do is connect the fuel lines back, make sure they're connected all the way, snug. it snap. That one snapped. Put the clamp back on. So we want to feel it snap. Do you feel it snap? There we go. Put the clamp back on. And there you go. New fuel filter in place. All I have to do is put pressure back onto the system and we're ready to rock. Alright, thanks a lot. See you guys next video.